Okay, we're up. And we can see the trees are really starting to change now. The sun setting, casting a shadow off the trees. Pick up a lot of the, the trees over here. Starting to change. Real pretty. Good flying for about 38 minutes. It's about 6.35. Just ran through a bunch of little bugs. Got to wipe them off my face. I think David had to work a little late tonight, so he's flying close to home. Take my sunglasses off. Looks a lot different. Put about two gallons of uh, 50 to 1 to the tank. Mixed it with a with probably about the 45 to 1. And so uh, the rest of the fuel that I have left is all 50 to 1 in the tank and uh, kind of a 45-50 mix. In the, uh, on the track. So getting close to the 50 to 1 pence. And uh, I was thinking I was probably going to use up the 5 gallons and that would probably be all I flew this year. Uh, I hope not. I hope that uh, it lasts a little, a little longer than that. Today I went to the doctor and had a steroid shot in my right shoulder. It's been hurting uh, really bad. I don't know, it was a year or two years ago. We were getting ready to fly. And, uh, and the wind was gusting on and off. And, it's, you know, we... A wind prediction was uh, supposed to be low winds, and uh, David had his strike set up with a weight up to it, and a big gust came, grabbed the wing, and just jerked that strike, and uh, we both went grabbing for it. I think I pulled my shoulder out of socket, uh, trying to trying to stop that strike, but uh, uh, I didn't stop it. It. Uh, that strike probably went up in the air about 10 feet and then uh, just landed uh, basically back down on the wheels and uh, nothing happened to it. it uh, that's a tough strike that David built. But ever since then, my shoulder has just been really uh, aching and I've had uh, x-rays and so forth. And uh, they do. They want to do some more X-rays, MRI, CT scan, all that other good stuff. So right now, I'm just taking some steroid shots, hoping that that uh, takes care of it.
Yeah, I might do a touch and go over here on this uh, property off to the right. It's an Amish property. Big pizza. Big, big area. If he's back here hunting, he'll get, he won't be happy. Flying for about 40, 48 minutes. They had a big uh, benefit out here about a week ago, a chicken barbecue, and uh, my understanding there was a lot of people there. I didn't go, but I think it's chicken. Cruising down here about 80 feet. Yeah, uh, probably better not to get too carried away. You're probably on your honey. It looks like the, uh, like basically just hanging there. The pole bends over quite a bit, so it looks real good. There's a deer right down there. Little one. over this pond and over this truck that's watching, pulled over to watch, and I'm just going to drop it off down here. And we're going to head for the truck.